Okay, let's go over a quick little posture check for exercise. Um, I'll do it from the side so you can kind of get a view of everything. So we'll start kind of top down. So again, we want to make sure our soft jaw, we're not clenching through our jaw, we're not clenching through our neck muscles, so really relax through there. I like to think about like I'm trying to hold an egg between my chin and my chest. So you don't want your chin way out here. Um, you want to kind of keep it soft and tucked in and stacked over the rest of your body. Um, then with shoulders, I don't really cue that like glue them together or back and down. That doesn't really get the position we're looking for. Instead, just think like you're holding two newspapers under your armpits and you're walking around. You don't want those newspapers to fall on the floor. What would that feel like for you? So that's just to get a more engaged shoulder position and you stop that forward roll. If you're holding the newspapers, you can't really hold them here, so you bring them back here. Palms are by your side swinging, they're not out in front because that again creates this like rounded position. So they're over here. And then we start thinking about what's happening with our ribs. Um, a lot of times, especially postpartum, we do get a bit of this rib flaring happening. So it either looks like this or it looks like this. And we don't want either of those. So thinking about bringing the tips of your rib cage and just tucking them down and in. Like you have a string on the edge or tip of each rib and those strings are getting pulled in towards belly button. So that kind of brings them in nicely here and it starts to engage that deep core as well. And then we'll go into the hip.